sorry, officer, but there's a crazy bet Perfect. going on. I'll send you the plans of the swarm missiles. You can now mount this weapon on all your ships. I'll let you know when your crazy bets are ready. Bye. All right. I'll go to Rusty's. You may come whenever you wish to mount your new weapon. Fo uh, new place, Rusty's. All right, back to Rusty's. Hey, I'm waiting for you at the boss's office. Use the city's tubular transport, indicated with the yellow arrow on your radar. Um, I guess I should go ahead and mount the missiles first and then do the story mission? Maybe? I don't know. I have to go to the newspaper to meet my boss. How exciting. See, I don't get that. Like, you just killed two cops. And you're like, okay, time to go to my minimum wage job at the newspaper. Uh, I think I'm overthinking this game too much. Once again, just because I've been spoiled by Anachronox, which is like, had a really good story and, and perfect writing and all this jazz. And I, I nothing's perfect, but it did have superb writing and so now I'm like well I want everything to have a story justification I want it to all make sense <laughs> Ooh, these are cool will I take damage if I fly through them no. this is a really cool world to be flying around and exploring I don't want to bitch too much about the uh, the story shortcomings um, <laughs> when there's such a cool area to explore this is awesome I mean, I, most likely I'll be spending most of, if not all, of the entire game in this zone. But uh, it's a very cool zone to, to chill out in. Do need to familiarize, familiarize myself with the uh, UI here. I'm not sure where my health bar and all that stuff is. The city's tubular transport, huh? It's right here. How do I park? Um. What is this thing? It's the communicator. There are no messages in the communicator. Okay. So, essentially, kind of feels like Space GTA, in a way. Except, you're not really just taking cars from anywhere. You're kind of building your own stuff. What do we have in here? To find me, follow your mission arrow. You can also ask a cop, and he'll show you the way. Do I not have, like, a notoriety system or something? Like, once again, I hate to beat, keep on beating this dead horse, but I am an outlaw right now. Maybe they're just trying to drive home that, like, crime and punishment works differently on Scrabble. Hey, buddy, how are you? Clear off! Aren't you too short to be a cop? I'm not short, but brief. It's thanks to our size that cops fit perfectly in the mechanical exoskeleton that destroys those who break the rules. Mechanical what? Do anything illegal and you'll see what I mean. <laughs> Would you be so kind as to show me how to get to the place indicated on my radar? Sure, follow me. Wait, wait, wait. Where are you going? Um... All these different points of interest. Ooh, who's she? Hey, sexy. Tiro? Is that her name? I can't I can't tell what that is. It's like it's either Tio Tiro or Taval or I don't know. I'm sure we'll meet her later. She uh <laughs> once again it reminded me of, like everything that I'm reminded of is I Ratchet and Clank or Star Wars pretty much. Um, I'm not even that big of a Star Wars fan, but Definitely a huge Dragon Clank fan, so I can't help but notice the similarities between that T Rao girl and uh, Courtney Gears from Ratchet and Clank. She seems pretty popular around here. Alright. Where's this teleport? Oh, there we go. Hi, Berto. Well, let's introduce you to the boss. Don't worry, he's a nice guy. 